I'm Kayla and welcome to my life. So as you guys can see by the title and the thumbnail to this video, today's video will be a back to school 2021 clothing haul. I am super excited for this video. I'm super excited for this clothing haul. This is like my first actual clothing haul that I'm doing. So I'm super excited for it. So I have a lot of stuff. Like when I say a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff. My school is a uniform school, so it's kind of more like accessories to add to the uniform. But I do have some stuff that is not a part of my uniform policy, but I'm still going to wear it because it's senior year. So I got to be the Beyonce. I have no choice but to be. I have to be the City Girls. I have to be the Megan, you know? So I have to give everything every single day. So yeah, let's jump right into the video. All right, you guys. So the first thing I have, you guys, is this cute little khaki tennis skirt. It looks like this it kind of has some wrinkles in it now y'all but it's just this cute tennis skirt it has like these really really deep pleats in it which makes it even cuter you guys i got this from ross and it was uh 13.99 and it is in the size large this skirt is super duper cute and my uniform colors are khaki but we it's khaki and black bottoms we're not allowed to wear skirts this is a skirt so i'm still gonna wear it because i see i've seen someone at my school literally wear a full-blown pencil skirt to school now i don't know if it's because of their beliefs or something like that but if they can do it i can do it too that's really how i feel so i'm gonna do it the skirt is really cute i feel like my led lights kind of make everything look a little bit weirder so we're gonna like turn them to white okay so yeah this is the skirt it is super duper cute it's like a dark kind of khaki it's not like the light khaki that most people get so yeah it has this little zipper on the side you guys to zip it up this kind of reminds me of like a cheerleading uniform so yeah this is the skirt from ross ross had a lot of good stuff when i went you guys like a lot a lot of good stuff so next up i have this sweater you guys so some of this stuff I bought last year when I thought I was going back to school and some of the stuff I bought this year. So if you don't know, last year I was going to be a junior when I went back. Well, I was a junior last year, but I didn't go back to physical school. I ended up staying home school because my mom didn't want me to go back. So some of this stuff I purchased last year thinking I was going to go back to school, even though my mom kept telling me, you're not going back, you're not going back. I still thought I was going back. So I went ahead and purchased some things. So I'm just going to show you guys what I got last year because it still has the tags on it because I haven't been able to wear it. So yeah. This is one item that I bought last year, you guys. It's just this teddy coat right here. I seen this same coat on Fashion Nova and it was $60. But I went to Rainbow and found it and I got it on sale for $7.99, you guys. And it's in a size medium. The original price of it was $16.99. So I would still rather pay $16.99 than $60 off Fashion Nova. Then you gotta pay for shipping. Mm -mm. So yeah, this is it. It has like this little, little I, I think it's elastic in here or whatever to make it kind of tight around your stomach so it kind of like crops it a little bit which is super cute it gives off like that really cute fur effect you know like obviously since i live in florida i probably won't wear it like right when school starts but when it gets cold down here because timing time it hits below 60 degrees everybody out on their track suits when i say everybody 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 from different states always say oh it's not even that cold you guys are doing the most but we're from florida it's always hot so time it time it drops the degrees babe it's freezing to us so it has this like little, okay, so you can make it like a turtleneck when you zip it up. Let me show you guys. When you zip it up, you can make it like look like a turtleneck like this, or you can just wear it unzipped, which is what I plan to do, like halfway unzip and then tuck it and kind of make it like a little tucked collar like this. So it's whatever you want it to be. It is super cute. And then the same elastic that's right here is the same elastic in the little sleeve. So like it kind of cuffs your hands. So this is super cute. I put this in one of my lookbooks last year for back to school. So Go watch that video if you want to see like how I paired this together. Of course, this year I'm planning to pair it differently because that was my style last year. This year I have like different styles. So I'm going to pair it with something else. Next up, you guys, I have this sweater. And this sweater was not for back to school. But since I did it, put it in my back to school clothing haul, I decided to, I mean, since I put it in my back to school lookbook that I recently posted, I decided to just go ahead and show it to you guys along with some other pieces. So this is a sweater from Forever 21 um i don't know the price because my boyfriend got it for me but it's in a size medium and it kind of gives off like that new york times um magazine effect on it it's super cute so it comes in this color right here it's cropped and it also has the same like not it doesn't have elastic like my other one but it has like this little string right here you guys and you could pull it to make it tighter or looser i don't know if i'm gonna be able to do it because my nails okay you could pull it like this to make it tighter or you can wear it looser it just depends on you it also has this hoodie on it and yeah, it just says like a whole bunch of things that newspapers have on it. It says New York Times, 
it says it says girl that takes me over all the streets it says yesterday's news read all about it warning signs of success so yeah it's just this really super cute crop jacket next i have another jacket i feel like i'm just doing all the jackets well i told you guys like that's how i dress up my uniforms mainly is with jackets or with belts or socks things like that so like i said you're not going to get like a lot of clothes you're going to get mainly jackets but it's fine so this is my next jacket you guys this jacket is 49.95 and it's in a size large and it came from aeropost it was just this it's another kind of like a teddy coat but it doesn't have like that teddy coat material it's not like a, i don't know how to explain it it's kind of like a teddy coat but not a teddy coat you get me so it has like i don't know why do i keep saying like okay so i don't know what type of material this kind of is like a carpet maybe a carpet material because it's not like the teddy coat material maybe a carpet i guess you can say and it is cropped also i love crop stuff like if you don't know i love crop stuff. i love for something to be out i love for stuff to be tight it just gives a cute vibe so it has it's this little crop right here at the bottom and it's all black it has the same zipper almost like the teddy coat and you can zip it up and make it a turtleneck or you can keep it unzipped like this and fold it and then you got your little collar however you want to do it it's in a size large from aeropostale and then it has the same little cuff sleeves i like when jackets have cuff, cuff sleeves and not regular sleeves because it really kills me when you put the jacket on and it's like dangling all the way down. I don't know why, but that really just frustrates me. Like, it just irks my nerves. Not even when I have it on, but when I see somebody else with it, it just really irks me. I like jackets that cuff right here. Like, why would you want your jacket all the way down? Like, I don't know. That's so weird to me. But yeah, this is it. Um, This is going to be for my medical. For like, whenever I have to do wear my scrubs, do anything medical, I'm going to wear this jacket. Because this is a look. This with the scrubs is definitely going to be a cute little look. So next, I have my long sleeve school shirt. This came from my school and it was $15. Yeah, it was $15. I got it in a size uh, small. And the reason why I got this in a size small and not a medium is because I want it to fit right on me. Like, I don't want it to be loose and big because I actually plan to wear this shirt this year. Most of the time when I get my shirts like this, I get them like an extra large so I can keep them for memories. But honestly, I, I hope and pray I don't ever get that big that I have to do that. I hope I'm able to keep my weight down, you know. I hope so i don't know but this is how it looks this is the front of it it says class of 2022 and then it says my school's name on it and then it has like our mascot but our mascot has like this cute little mask on it for you know the pandemic and then uh, the back of it it says bucking since 18 and then it has like a little uh, skeleton thing on it so yeah this is the shirt it's super cute i think i'm gonna wear this on the first week i don't really know i i think i'm gonna wear it but definitely not on like the first or the second day because mm -mm next you guys i got these little latex pants these black latex pants right here people call these trash bag pants but the real name of them is latex latex shorts and this is how they look you know they're they are kind of i can see how people call it trash bag but they're like this they're, they're like shorts but they're like kind of capris in a way not capris do capris stop above your knee like these go all the way down to my knee so i think those are capris i forgot which ones are called capris but i think these are capris so yeah this is how they look um i got these from mad rags i believe and i think they're a size medium or they might be a large because yeah these are a size large and i got them from mad rags and they were on sale for two dollars this is how they look i know for sure i'm wearing these on the first week of school because this my outfits for the first week is about to be looks back to 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 back like it's really up nobody's ready nobody's prepared because the looks is coming through i'm giving the girls i'm giving the girls like every day like it's giving it's senior year it's up it's really up so next y'all i have this shirt that is 25 dollars off of an instagram boutique you name it 25 i'll leave a link in the description box it's um it's a boutique where you can get like custom shirts so i got this in a size large um as you guys know i'm in the medical program so i came up with this like cute little design right here and it says dr senior on it and then it has 2022 because that's the class i am it has a stethoscope and everything like that and it has like the little um needle right here i don't know if you guys can see it like the syringe needle yeah so it's super cute and it says dr senior so what i did basically was come up with a design and i drew it out on a shirt like i i got a piece of paper drew a shirt and then drew what i wanted on the shirt marked the colors that i wanted took a picture dm'd it to her and she was able to make it and this is how it looks dr senior 2022 don't play with me and i got it in a size large so it's pretty big normally i need a i'm like in between a, a small and a medium recently i don't know why but that's like the size that i'm in between right now but i went ahead and got this one in a large because i think i want to wear it as a dress i don't know yet i haven't decided but i think i want to wear it as a dress but even if i don't wear it as a dress then i'll cut it 
but just in case I want to, I decided to like get it a little bit bigger and it's in the color gray. Super duper cute. You can get it in any color you want. I just chose gray because that's like the theme of my medical program, which goes along with my patch. So I don't know if you guys can see like in my patch, the colors. So that's why I decided to get my shirt gray with the tail to match. So yeah, this is my patch y'all. I got a patch for my uniform that I have to put it on. So next you guys, I have this other sweater that's from Forever 21. My boyfriend got it for me. It's in a size medium. Um, it is cropped also. I don't know how much it was because like I said, he got it for me. But it's really cute. It's like this cream, like this off-white type of color, you guys. And then it has khaki and then this hot pink. Super duper cute. It has a hoodie on it. And it has a, it's, this is a jacket, not a sweater. So that means it zips all the way down like you don't pull it over your head. I think it's too bright. You guys can't even really see. But yeah, you zip it all the way down. And this one is super duper cute also. I like this one better than the newspaper one. He likes the newspaper one better. But this one just is it's so cute. I don't know why. I like this one so much more. So this is how it looks from Forever 21. Super duper cute. I feel like if I put on khaki shorts, a white uniform shirt, and then find some pink shoes, like this would be such a cute outfit for school. So yeah, this is how it looks, you guys. Next, I have my emergency kit in here, which I'm not going to go into detail and open this and show you guys this because I did an emergency kit video. So go to into the video, but my emergency kit is in here. It's pretty heavy. Next, I have this uh, graphic, well, it's not a graphic tee, but this t-shirt dress thing that my boyfriend also gave me. It's in a size 2X. It says it was $28. I don't really know if it was $28, but I know it came from DTLR. It's the Lucky Charm brand. And this is it. So before I show it to you guys, I asked, I was doing um a clothing haul and I kind of got my food on it. So yeah, I haven't even worn it out yet and I already messed it up. I don't know. Look, and I, this is bleach. I use bleach to get it off, but I, I don't think I was supposed to do that. So it's kind of like messed up now, but it's okay. I'm going to try to figure out how to get it off. But this is the shirt, you guys. This is how it looks. It's just this white t-shirt. It's really big and long on me. And then it has like this cute little teddy bear right here. This pink teddy bear. And it has like a red rose. And then it says Lucky Charms on it. I mean, why did I say Lucky Charms? Lucky Charm. So yeah, it's this super cute shirt. I'm going to wear this to a football game. Though. I'm not going to wear it to school. I'm going to wear it to a football game. I don't know what game, but I'm going to wear it to a football game. Next, I have this little um, number two jit bit. I have two of them, but I don't know where the other one is. And it's class of 2022. Duh, that's why I got it for my Crocs. So yeah, I had two, but I don't know where it went. And I really tried to look for it, but I just gave up after a certain point because I don't know where it went. I don't know. Next, you guys, I have these anklets right here. So it's a pack of three anklets. If the camera will focus, there you go. No, why is it not focusing in? It's a pack of three anklets. So one of my anklets say love on them, like love in diamonds right here. I don't know if you guys can see, there you go, love in diamonds. And then this one has these two little hearts that dangle on the side and they both say love on them. And then this one is just like a little diamond anklet. Like it's, it's nothing to it, it just has diamonds on it. If it will focus, I don't know why it's not focusing. It's not focusing, but it just has diamonds on it. And this is by the brand Nicole Anklet, but I really got these from the hair store and they were only $1.99 for a pack of three. So that's that. Next, you guys, I got some Instastax and a Polaroid camera. So this is my Instastax Mini 9 Polaroid camera. This is how it looks. It is in this color like plum purple right here. It is really, really cute. And then I also got some Instastax from Walmart. The Instastax were like $8, $7. I don't really remember. But I got it um, in a two-pack. It comes with 20. And I got this color. Um, I don't know how to describe it, but it's like a pack that has a whole bunch of different prints on it. Like around the um, little frame of the Polaroid. So I got this pack because I'm planning to take like pictures. A lot, a lot of Polaroid pictures because it's senior year. My last year, I need to capture like all these moments. And I want to make like this. This little cute little frame by the end of the year. And then I got this pack right here, you guys. And this pack just has like different um, frame, like rainbow frames. So these have designs on them. And then the, these just have like regular frames. I think I'm going to use these first. But I might use these. I don't know. I don't know which ones I'm going to use. But I have to figure it out. Because you once you put it in there, you have to use all those up before you change it out. So I'm going to have to figure that out. I don't know which ones. So I think we're, oh, we're almost to the shoes, you guys. We're really close to the shoes. So next, I have these black jeans that I got from Old Navy. They're in a size 8, and they were $20.99. Um, they're on sale. Old Navy jeans are expensive. I didn't know they were that expensive, but they're on sale. So I got these for $20.99. They're just regular black jeans. This is how they look. Um, 
I got them super skinny though because I like skinny I told you guys I like skinny and tight stuff so yeah these are them they're super cute I don't know what I'm I don't know if I'm gonna wear, I keep saying I don't know what I'm gonna wear a lot of stuff with I have like ideas in my head I don't like when my hair looks all puffed up and frizzy but I have some ideas in my head on what I want to wear but like I haven't like justified it or secured it basically but yeah it's just these regular black jeans i love black jeans i love wearing them to school i like black jeans rather than black uniforms you guys next i have some pads um why am i showing this to you guys i don't know it was over there in the pile of um uniform stuff so i assume that you guys probably want to know i got pads oh oh i remember i remember i had these pads because if you remember i didn't have enough to put in my emergency kit and i said i was gonna get more i got more gotta put them in there though but i got more so next you guys i have a whole bunch of socks like slouch socks is my thing slouch socks is my thing i have so many pairs already i have like 15 pairs of slouch socks and i went and bought so many more for school i just bought the clothes i didn't have so um each one of these were two dollars and fifty cent each i don't know who would really pay that much for socks if you're not like a socks fanatic like me but i got this little cute purple right here you guys like this dark purple um it's nothing really to it. they're just slouch socks if you don't know what slouch socks are it's basically like these socks that you put on and you slouch them down and then they look all scrunchy cute people call them scrunch, scrunchy socks too i used to call them scrunchy socks until i found out they were called slouch socks because when you look up scrunchy socks nothing really pops up but then when you look up slouch socks a whole lot pops up so they're called slouch socks so my mom ended up finding somewhere that sells them for $1.99 after i bought all these socks at first i used to buy them three dollars a pair three dollars a pair like they start taxing for socks i don't know why but three dollars a pair i was like okay that's a good deal because before that they used to be five dollars and i was not spending five dollars well i was but you know in my head i'm like i'm not spending five dollars on socks so then when the price got down to three dollars well when the other lady started selling them for three dollars i decided to go to her and forget the five dollars because no i'm not paying five dollars when i can find them for three dollars so then i went to her but then she like her shop just disappeared it vanished i don't know where it went so i couldn't go there to get the socks anymore but when i went there the same day looking for her i found a new lady and she sells her for 250 so i'm like boom you my new you my new sock lady because you sell them for 250 but then just yesterday i bought these like two weeks ago just yesterday my mom sent me a picture while i was asleep talking about she found the socks for 199 so now i'm in distress because i just spent an extra 50 cent on each pair of socks when i could have just went somewhere else and got them for 199 but it's fun it's so fun it's so fun because i don't even know if they have these colors that i got so i'm not even gonna trip for real so next you guys i got this cute little gray socks so if you pay attention to some of the stuff in my haul you will kind of know what outfits i'm wearing with what because i got like everything to match but just in case y'all kind of missed the memo we're gonna go ahead and go back to this cute look this cute custom custom made senior shirt with the gray socks drip drip check yeah yeah but it's just this light gray scrunchy socks right here you guys this is how they look slouch socks scrunchy socks y'all can hear me say all the names because i really just call them everything honestly it's just like this light gray this is kind of like a sweatpants gray and this is how they look next i got till which if you guys pay attention to the detail babes details drip yeah I got this teal color right here. I got my socks in a size 6 to 8.5 um, because that's kind of like the size of my feet. My feet, I normally I wear a 6 or a 6.5 in shoes or a 5 or a 5.5. That's like a, that's a big gap. But I don't know, it's just certain shoes fit my feet differently. So, yeah, I got a teal pair. Next, I got a khaki pair, you guys, but I didn't buy these from the lady. I bought this from a pop-up shop that I went to. Ooh, something's in my ah. Okay, I bought this from a pop-up shop that I went to you guys, and I paid three dollars for these. No, not three dollars. I paid four dollars for these. So why did I pay four dollars for these? Because they're khaki and my uniform is khaki, so I had to get them because khaki, khaki, like it just I just had to get them. So I was really willing to pay seven dollars if I had to for these. I would pay seven dollars because I need a pair of khaki. Like, do you know the vibe that I'm gonna set with these khaki socks? Like. I'm just envisioning myself in everything and I'm just really about to be dripped out like it's over with for everybody so next you guys I have these see look this is the real brand of slouch socks that I used to get this is the this is the brand right here this is like the old school brand like the first brand before this brand that I know about if you know about this brand first before me I'm just saying what I know about 
So look, this is how the, this is how the, the real slap socks used to look, y'all. I got this from the same lady. I don't know why she, I don't know why she has different brands, but this is how they look. But this is the new updated one. It's not new, new. They've been out for some time, but I'm just saying like the updated one. And as you guys can see, these slouch way more than these. Like way more. Look how look at the the slouch effect in these, and then look at the slouch effect in these. This you can tell it's slouch. This seems like you might have made it slouch. You know what I mean? So yeah, I like this brand better. If you guys wanted to know, like all my old ones, well not all my old ones, but a lot of them are this brand. But this brand is better. I don't know why this one slouches more. I think, I think this this is dedicated to like slouch. You know, like this brand was made for slouch socks, and then this brand was just made for socks, and then added slouch. You know, I don't know. But I got this little burgundy color right here, and I got this for my feelers that I bought in tenth grade. Um, but I couldn't wear them that much because school we had to go home and learn online so i got these for those because they're like this forest green and burgundy color so that's what i got these for that's how they look just burgundy socks and yeah that's all my socks you guys that i got so i have another pouch i mean another pouch what another patch in here and this is how it looks just um another school pouch nothing big next you guys i bought this lip gloss this 24k y'all know how i feel about my gloss i don't even have to say too much y'all know how i feel about my gloss go check out my lip gloss collections i've made two well i recorded three posted two i have another one that's supposed to drop in september but it might not drop in september because i started filming back to school videos so like now i have to go back and reschedule everything so i don't know but i bought this 24k Ro not rose gold 24k gold lip gloss by ruby kiss it was 199 my mom bought me like last year the 24k rose gold one so when i seen this one i knew i had to have it because i have to have like the whole collection so i went ahead and bought this one it came from the hair store you guys so next i feel like i'm always saying next that's gonna irritate me so bad when i'm editing when i keep saying next 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 that's gonna make me so mad but oh well so next i'm so late next okay seriously next you guys we have these little these are like kind of like i like these give me like boy short vibes like the big shorts that the boys wear but they came from rainbow and in rainbow's girl store so yeah i got them on sale for five dollars and i got these in a size small you guys and they're like this this tan tan or khaki whatever color you want to call it when i go to school and wear these i'm gonna call it khaki and they're gonna have to argue with me back and forth about whether these are tan or khaki and i better not be put in no csi for these because they're khaki shorts Anyway, they're like these khaki shorts right here, you guys. And they come with like pockets on them and everything like that. And I know everybody's been seeing like the trend of the girls putting on like the boy, these boy shorts right here with a cute top and just rocking it and just really giving it to the boys for real. And that's what I want to do. Like I want to wear these shorts with like a graphic tee with some shoes and some socks and just like really kill the game. Like I think these socks match pretty good. Not really, but they kind of match. I don't know. But I think I'm going to do something like that. I just can't wait. Yeah, so these are the shorts. Super duper cute. These for sure I know will not be worn on the first week of school. But they're going to be worn. Just not on the first week. So next, you guys, I have this long sleeve collared shirt. I got it from Walmart yesterday in my Prepare Me for Back to School vlog that I'm filming right now. It's going to be my hair, my nails, me shopping, me packing my book bag. So y'all got to wait to see that video. Y'all going to see that video after this one. Yeah. After this video, it's going to be posted. So, I think this video is going to be posted on Saturday. This video is going to be posted on Saturday. So, on Wednesday or Monday, you're going to see me, my prepared video. Okay? Okay. So, um, yeah, I got this shirt. This is in the kids section. It's a large 1012 plus. So, let me tell you guys a quick story. I tried one of 1416, which is the biggest Walmart size in kids that they had in the long sleeve. Walmart's kids normally goes to 18, and I can fit at 18. But the biggest size they had in long sleeve was a 1416. So I got it just to like play around in there and see if I could fit it because who knows, maybe I could fit it, right? So I got it and believe it or not, I was able to fit it, but it was like tight on me. But something told me to try on the 1012 Plus to see and this shirt was looser than the 1416. And I just thought that was so weird. But um, when I was talking, I, I think I was talking to my mom. I think my, was it my mom or my grandma? I don't know but one of them told me that the reason why is because when you find stuff in plus it makes the width of the shirt and the the like the width of the sleeve the width of the actual shirt it makes it bigger for like you know wider kids who might wear 10 12 you know what i mean so that's why it fit me looser than the 1416 so yeah this is the shirt just the regular white one 
Yes, it's from the kids section because I know every single time somebody sees the pink collar on the inside, especially at school, they're always like, that's a kid's shirt. I really don't care. A shirt is a shirt to me. So, yeah, this is how it looks. Long sleeve white shirt with the collar and it has like these regular buttons. It's kind of like, it's like a uniform shirt. It just has sleeves on it, you know? So, yeah, I got it from Walmart. 10, 12 plus and it was like $6 or something like that. It was like $6.46 with tax. It's $5.97 and then with tax it was like $6.46. So, that's that shirt. Uh, next, you guys, I have so much stuff. Okay, next I got these pants right here. Now, I know they look kind of crazy. They came from Rainbow. They're in a size large. I've already worn them, and I might have a picture of how they look. But it's just like these black jogger pants. They're like high-waisted. Um, I put them in my clothing haul, so go tune into that video if you want to see. Not my clothing haul, my lookbook, so go tune into that video. But yeah, it has like these little buttons, and it's like these silver buttons, and you button it up, and it's like high-waisted, you guys. And then the bottom of the pants, yes, they look wrinkly because I washed them. So when you put the bottom of the pants on, you guys, it goes into like this little cute little jogger look. So like they're kind of, they look like they're in the water, but they're not in the water. They're joggers. You know what I mean? So yeah, I got these. I'll probably put a picture because I can't really like describe these so good because they're all like messed up. They were $12.99 though. And they're in a size large from Rainbow. So I think that's like all my clothes, you guys. And now it's time to get into my favorite, favorite, favorite part, which is the shoes. I love shoes so much. So I might have to went a little bit overboard, but it's fine. It's totally fine. Actually, wait, I have one more thing, two more things to show you guys. If you guys saw me unbox my book bag, this is my book bag right here. This is Spray Ground um, Power Buff Girl Edition, the limited edition, never sold again edition. Yeah, that's my book bag, never sold edition. So I went into detail about my book bag, how much it costs, everything like that in my unboxing. So make sure you go tune into my unboxing to see. But I also went and bought my water bottle yesterday in my vlog that I told you guys I'm going to be posting. And this is my water bottle right here. This is how it looks. It matches my book bag so freaking good, you guys. So freaking good. So uh, I'm thinking about giving it to You Name It 25 so they can put like a print on it for me, like a Powerpuff Girl print or my name or something like that. That's what I'm thinking about doing because if you don't know, You Name It 25 just sells everything custom. So that's what I'm thinking about doing, but I don't know for sure yet. But it's just this water bottle and it keeps... um my drink hot for 12 hours and it keeps my drink cold for 24 hours it's a 32 ounce double wall insulated bottle bpa free leak proof and this is how it looks it is super cute and i feel like it matches my book bag really good and i drink a lot a lot of water at school like a lot of water i will always but the thing is my water has to be cold like i hate drinking room temperature or hot water i don't know why but i will always bring one frozen water bottle to school and i would drink that then when lunchtime came uh I would steal my boyfriend's water bottle and then after lunch when we're leaving lunch and going back to class i would steal my cousin's water bottle which left me with three water bottles during the whole day and then after school i would have to go to the vending machine to buy me one which means i drank four water four bottles of water every day while i was at school so i feel like just using this keeping it filled up i should be good for the whole day hopefully because my boyfriend doesn't go to my school anymore so i'm kind of out of gas with that water bottle and then the vending machine my mom doesn't want me to keep touching the buttons that everybody else is touching at school so i'm kind of out of gas with that and then my cousin doesn't even know if he's coming back. So I'm kind of on my own with this whole water thing. So got me a water bottle. Hopefully I remember to fill it up every night. But I think I am because it's going to be the same as like my other when I used to bring my frozen water bottle. Every night I will remember to put it in the freezer. The only difference is I don't put this in the freezer. I just fill it up with ice and water and put it in the refrigerator. So I think I'm going to remember. It is super cute. I can't wait to drink out, drink out of this, y'all. Today is Tuesday. Today is Tuesday. School starts next monday girl six more days and we back in school i cannot wait i'm super excited y'all senior year what it's about to be a whole movie out here let me grab all these shoes because i want a lot of shoes it's about to be a whole freaking movie y'all so next y'all got these crocs of course they're not real crocs but like they look like crocs or whatever um these came from mad rags and they were only four dollars my mom i was at work they they're normally 14.99 but they were on sale i was at work and my mom called me and she was like do you want these crocs i was like yeah i want them she was like i seen these red crocs i'm like you want them i was like yes duh so i forgot what type of crocs i think they were the off white crocs or something like that and they had like this thick bottom right here do you guys know what i'm talking about they're like pink I forgot, I forgot what type of Crocs they were, but I remember they were going around on TikTok and these kind of like give me that vibe a little bit, even though they're not pink and stuff, they kind of give me that vibe. So yeah, just these little red ones. And this is where I'm going to put the 22 on these, you guys, and I'm going to wear these to school with my scrubs. It's going to be a look once again. So the normal passes are $14.99. I had to get these in a size seven. I would have got these in a six, but they run really, really small. And even with me getting them in a size seven, you guys, my foot is like just making it into the crop girl so we we struggling a little bit but they're cute so i'm gonna keep them in they're only four dollars so if they don't fit for a long time just four dollars 
so next i have these jordans now these these are another pair of shoes that i bought what well, my mom bought for me go thinking well they're for my birthday but my birthday is in june and then school's right up my mom said oh these could be your birthday shoes but she could also wear them keep them as a first day of school shoe you know and i was like yeah that's smart but girl we didn't go back to school so i just been wearing them and we haven't been in school but it's just these Jordans right here. You guys probably seen these Jordans a hundred times. So I'm not about to go into detail about them. But yeah, just these little slight Jordans, slight drip, slight drip. I'm wearing these on the first week. I don't know what, I think the fourth them wears. I don't know. But they're in a size 6.5. They're kind of big, but kind of not big. It's like, they're like, the thing, the thing with my foot is sometimes I could put on a 6 and it'll be too small like my foot will be right at the tip then i can get a 6.5 and then my foot will be like right here like this is the top of the shoe and this is my foot you know what i mean it's so weird that that happens to me but it happens so ease you guys i tried on the six it was too small i got a 6.5 and now my foot is like right here and then the shoe the, the the tip of the shoe is like right here it's so weird but yeah i got these in a 6.5 so next you guys i have my vans y'all know i love vans i am a fiend for vans vans is like my favorite shoe brand in the world like vans i was actually gonna get like three pairs of vans this year and my mom she goes uh don't you think you need to like switch it up you're gonna look the same like with the vans the vans vans but i just love vans so much but i ended up only getting one pair of vans kind of like a teardrop but not really because once school starts probably like within the third week i'm getting me another pair because i already know another pair that i want to get but that's not the point so i got these vans from kids foot locker and they're in the size six they were 50 dollars, you guys and they're just these cute sparkle vans look how cute these are they're like rose gold with like a hot pink y'all these are so freaking cute like so freaking cute and like the camera is not even giving the shoe justice bruh like look how good the shoe looks bruh like look at this shoe like this shoe is just it's gold it's gold like come on now look at this shoe it really gives the girls expensive like i said kids foot locker and oh baby they were 53 dollars 50 dollars 50 dollars i think they were 50 and then tax made them 53 dollars but yeah these are so cute i'm i'm giving vibes i'm giving vibes with these so normally i get my vans y'all in a 5.5 or 5 but the thing is the 5.5 like my toe is literally like kind of right there in my other van so i decided to go up a size but now my toe is kind of like like again right here in these two but i i can't i don't know i'd rather have like my shoe to be a little bit big than tight because wearing tight shoes is a no for me so that is what it is so next you guys are these shoes right here that i got from mad Raz. yeah i got these from mad Raz, and they were 7.99 they're just these little cute pink shoes look how cute these are you guys these are super cute pink and gray and this is another pair of shoes that i had all oh, like i'm going back to school junior year didn't go so yeah it's just these cute little shoes right here they have like this silver metallic right here then like this light gray then this like lime green then in the back you have like this hot pink super cute super cute i'm in love with this shoe this shoe is super cute this is in a size seven the original price for these are 24.99 but of course i got them on sale and they were $7.99. Super duper cute. I can't wait to wear these. I don't think these are going to be worn on the first week. But they might be. I don't know. I don't really know. Like the reason why I keep saying I don't know if it's going to be worn is because while I'm showing you guys, I'm kind of thinking like do I want to wear it or do I not want to wear it? I really don't know. So next, you guys, I got these right here. Oh, these are just so freaking cute. Like look at this. This is, this is raw, bro. This is raw. Like these shoes right here. But get into it. Get into it right quick yes you see them you see them so i got these from that rags you guys um the original pass of these were 34.99 but i ended up getting them for ten dollars ten freaking dollars y'all so let me give y'all a backstory on these if you guys don't know i recently took my senior pictures on the 31st i took my senior pictures i vlogged it and everything like that i'm just waiting to make my thumbnail i need to wait to my senior pictures and my actual pictures come in so i can make the thumbnail then i'll post the video you know but i vlogged and everything like that and my idea was when i first saw these i saw these okay so i took my pictures july 31st i saw these shoes in june okay i saw it was like june 7th no june 8th i saw these shoes i saw them like mom can i please get these for my senior pictures can i please please get them and she's like are you sure you're gonna wait on your senior pictures michaela and i was like yes and then she was like okay so get the outfit first then we can come back and get the shoes but long story short y'all we did not find an outfit that would go good with these shoes but i still wanted the shoes so i was like you know what i'm gonna get them for the first day of school i'm just gonna get them and wear them for the first day of school so when i went to go get them turns out they didn't have my size so i've been looking going into my rest looking 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 
couldn't find them and then finally the lady the lady had one size it was a size 10 and i go do you have these any more of these smaller she told me no i went to all the mad like so many mad rats. she said no and she was like actually we're stopped we're done selling them like we're not getting anymore and then it was my luck i'm telling you like two weeks ago y'all or was it last week last week or two weeks ago i go into mad rats, not even looking for these shoes anymore since she said she doesn't sell them and i found them on clearance for ten dollars like when i say these shoes were meant for me dog these shoes were meant for me and the crazy part is i didn't even know they were ten dollars the sh inside the shoe you guys it says twenty dollars right there so i'm thinking they're twenty dollars and i'm like i don't care i'm paying ten dollars for them i don't care i will pay 50 for these 68 90 100 i will pay however much for these these are raw so i'm like i don't care i go up there she scans the shoe she goes it's ten dollars i'm like ten dollars she was like yes i'm like no way and it was tax free week girl so i got it for ten dollars like look how cute get into it so i don't know let me put a picture of my idea with these is to wear these with the gray shirt but i really don't know because i got another pair of shoes that look good with the gray shirt so i don't know y'all gotta comment down below and please comment because school is starting literally will you see this on saturday sunday and then monday i'm at school so please comment and let me know which ones i should wear please okay so yeah this is these right here you know they kind of look like they have like two it's like iridescent diamonds basically and it is super duper cute so yeah i got those you guys so i might wear this with the gray shirt if you guys tell me it's cute but let me show you the other shoe before you say yes wear those with the gray shirt okay so look y'all i got these freaking lugged converse now these are another pair of shoes that i had to run around for so apparently apparently all of a sudden when i want to find it first of all i wanted this shoe last christmas not the christmas that just passed but the christmas before that i wanted this shoe but um i didn't get the shoe for christmas like no big deal i didn't get the shoe so i've been thinking like i want it i want it but i i'm the type of person that if i want something and i tell my mom well my mom's that person i need a reason why i need to get it like she'll be like is it for back to school is it for i feel like i need a reason and i didn't have a reason i just wanted them so bad so i was like you know what i'm not even because i'm gonna be like okay let's stop spending all your money on shoes so i was like i'm not gonna get them but when back to school came, I'm like, oh, yeah, I'm getting them. I need them. So long story short, y'all, um, I went to Journeys. Journeys said that they, I went online. No, I went to Journeys in the store first, and they told me that they don't have this color anymore. So then I was like, okay, whatever. I went to Rack Room. They told me they don't have this color anymore. I went to Converse, the actual Converse store. They told me they don't sell lugged Converse. They told me they don't sell long lugged Converse in their store. Like they give it to other stores to sell. So I couldn't find it there. I went to Finish Line. I went to Champs. I went to all the shoe stores that you could think of looking for these shoes. And I could not find them. I could not find them. Then I started going online. I went to Kohl's online. I went to Rack Room online. Vans online. Not Vans. Converse online. I went everywhere online. And they have the Lux Converse, but they don't have it in the black and white. And literally, like, four times I got excited thinking I found them because, like, the picture was black and white. But then when I clicked on it, they turned to all white or green and white. And I'm like, what the heck, bro? Like, why, why are y'all catfishing me and playing with me? But I finally decided to, like, call this one rack room that's in, like, this outlet mall that we have. I'm like, let me call them and see if they have it. And this was the last one, y'all. The last pair i'm like do you have the black and white lug converse i'm like the black and white ones don't tell me about your white ones don't tell me about your gray ones don't tell me about your green ones i need the black and white and he goes uh i think we do let me check and then he goes and he's like okay before i tell you yes what size do you need i said i need a size seven wait backstory on why i got a seven so when i was uh, the whole time you guys when i was looking online i kept inputting 6.5 6.5 but the man at journeys he was trying to sell me like these tie-dye of these since he didn't have the black and white ones he was trying to sell me the tie-dye ones and he's like here try these on you might like them and of course i'm not going to say no because you know he's trying to get a sale so i'm going to play with him if he wants me to try it on and he wants me to make him think i'm getting it i'm gonna just do it so i tried it on and it was a 6.5 too small my foot could not go in there so i'm like i actually need to try this on in a seven and he gave me a seven and it ended up fitting and i think god did that for a reason because i would have been telling that man at rack room i needed a 6.5 and he would have been like no i don't have it and then i wouldn't have had the shoe but because i tried it on in that store i knew i needed a seven and guess what his last pair was a seven back to my rack room story so he called uh, after i said that he's like girl you're in luck we have a seven i'm like you're lying he's like no i'm for, for real i'm like bruh are you serious i'm like he's like yeah i'm like oh my god no way i've literally been going everywhere looking for these shoes like the amount of gas and the amount of time i've wasted just to find these shoes you would like be so in shock and he's like i have them i'll hold them for you i'm like no you don't gotta hold them well you gotta hold them but you only gotta hold them for 30 minutes i'm on the way right now y'all when i tell you i jumped in the car right when he said yes like i told him i said mom they got the shoes i gotta go 
I gotta go. I jumped right into the car, babes, and I was there. There. Like, I, I, I had to get these. Like, these are just, these are just like a vibe. Like, look at them, y'all. They're so freaky cute. So, I had to go up, as I told you guys. So, these are a size 7. Um, normally, like I said, I'm in between a 5 and a 6.5. So, yeah, these are a 7. They're $74, and I got them from Rack Room Shoes. I hope I told you guys the price of all of these other shoes, but I think I did. So, my last pair of shoes, which actually just came in today. I could have did my haul last Sunday, y'all. But I was just waiting on this one more pair of shoes. One more pair. So they're kind of out of the box. So you guys can already see them. These are um, Nike shoes. Uh, Nike Air Structure shoes. And they're in the size 6.5. And this is how they look, you guys. So before I get to detail these shoes, tell me, you guys. With the teal shirt that I showed you guys, right? My crown is also teal. I'll put a picture on the screen because I don't feel like going over there to get it. Which shoe should I wear? I'm going to wear the teal and the grass crunchy size. I'm going to wear both of the socks. But which shoe should I wear? Should I wear these right here or should I wear these? Y'all comment down below and let me know because your girl need help, okay? But these shoes were $74. I got these shoes in a size 6.5. Um, My foot is literally like right here and then the shoe's right here. But when I tried on the 6, my foot was like touching it. So I had to get a 6.5. And I had actually went in the store to get these, but I had to order them. Well, she or the lady ordered them online for me because they didn't have them in a 6.5. So, yeah. This is how they look. And these are in the boys section. 6.5 in the boys, which I thought it was women, which is probably why it's kind of like a little bit big. Maybe I should have got a 6.5 in women. I don't know. But this is the shoe right here, you guys. It is super duper cute. So I mainly got this shoe because I seen the structure of the shoe I like. But I wasn't going to originally get it in this color, you guys. I was going to get it in all black. But then when I seen this, I was like, I have to get this because it has the gray and the teal and my crown. My shirt is gray and teal. My scrubs are gray and teal. So I'm like, I need these shoes. So I was like, forget the black ones. I'm going to just get these since I already have a black Converse, you know. So yeah, this is how they look. Super cute. I can't wait to wear these. These might be worn on the first week. It depends on y'all. If y'all comment down below and let me know which ones I should wear on the first week. Then if y'all said these, then these are getting worn on the first week. If y'all said the white ones, these gotta go. Gotta, put back, gotta be put back in the closet. And we gotta wait. So that really concludes my clothing haul, y'all. Or my back, yeah, my back to school clothing and shoe haul. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I can't wait to film my back to school. Get ready with me for the first day of school, my last first day. I cannot wait to film that video. But of course, before we film that video, we gotta finish filming the preparation video. So make sure your post notifications on so you can stay tuned for me to drop that preparation video, girl. The nails, the hair, the lashes, everything is really up and it's stuck. And I just really can't wait. I really can't wait. So I gotta stay tuned. You know, we really lit on the road to 40 subscribers. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, make sure your post notifications on. And like the city girls and the city boys say, period. Act dog, you can get slapped up. Don't call your real daddy since you want to. Act dog, you can get smashed up.